We're on the eighth part of Psalm 119, and uh, in verse uh, 59, uh, the psalmist says, I've considered my ways, and I've turned my steps to your statutes. We need to examine our lives often. Uh, often there are things in our lives that are mindsets in our lives that, that don't need to be there or, or shouldn't be there. Uh, and therefore we can ask ourselves questions, uh, three questions uh, to look at today. The first question is, do we realize that God is all we need? Uh, verse 57, you are my portion, Lord. Uh, and that word portion means inheritance. It means that, that God is, is what we inherit. He, he is our riches. Uh, and the people of God often didn't believe God would come through for them. And they turned to other things, they turned to other gods or other nations. And uh, so many people today have a primary ambition of seeking wealth or honour or pleasure or fame rather than seeking first the kingdom of God. And the psalmist examined his heart to ensure that God was first because in God he found his true riches, his true joy, his true meaning and purpose. God is who we need. You are my portion, Lord. Uh, the second question we can ask ourselves as we examine our lives is do we delay uh, on acting upon spiritual things so, uh, verse 59 i have considered my ways and have turned my steps to your statutes i will not hasten i sorry i will hasten and not delay it's important that we take care of things uh, immediately you know if you're running low on petrol in your car uh it's at your peril if you don't stop at a garage to get it refueled uh, if a bill comes through your door and uh, uh, we don't pay it, then we run into lots of problems. We do these things as quickly as, as we can. And so it is with spiritual matters, spiritual things. Uh, the Bible says today is the day uh, of salvation. So don't keep putting off uh, to tomorrow what can be done today. And so when you examine uh, your life, uh, turn your steps towards God's ways uh, without delay. The third question we can ask ourselves is do we forget that God is always listening, that his love is always available at any time and everywhere? Verse 62, at midnight, I rise to give you thanks for your righteous laws. Verse 64, the earth is filled with your love, Lord. So we can examine our lives, put God first, you are my portion straight away we can call on him at any moment in any situation amen